Less than 1% of the population is highly tolerant of CS gas. But Sunday afternoon, cadets of Basic Camp 3rd Regiment experience the effects of CS gas by going through the Seaburn Chamber. They go through chemical, biological, radiological, and nuclear training. It consists of not only their equipment, they also have to go through the CS Chamber, uh, which is similar to tear gas. The chamber has an effect similar to tear gas and is highly irritating. So a lot of effects that they, they feel is actually like an irritant. So like their eyes and their nose will start to burn, their skin will definitely burn, especially if it's hot outside because their pores open up. Uh, those are a lot of the effects that they feel. They also feel that they can't breathe, so it does have a kind of a, a choking effect, which causes them to panic. And when someone feels they can't breathe, that's when they really start to lose their control. Hold your breath, hold your eyes, and you'll reseal when they tell you to. Do not take your mask off. The purpose of the Seaburn Chamber is to teach cadets to trust their equipment and to become familiar with how to use the equipment. The effects cadets felt only lasted a few minutes before they wore off. I'm Morgan Lloyd with the Cadet Summer Training Public Affairs Office.